Hello from West Sussex where today I'm watching a football team who are owned by NFTs. Wally Town Football Club, who uh, were taken over midway through last season by Wagme United. Probably couldn't pick that up, but they, that sounds for We're All Gonna Make It, which was the low the slogan for NFTs and crypto and all that crap when that was popping off. Um, but that's sort of the bottom's really fallen out of that lately, so I am interested to see. I'm just already going forwards. Hopefully they don't fall a similar fate. But yeah, I just went through the fan park. Some really good options. I've gone for the burger, but there was all sorts. So that was really cool. But let's see what the actual ground is like. I've just got managed to get it wiped away by the nice burger people, but uh, they shat on my seagull. Not, not ideal pre-match prep. <laughs> But you know what? It's meant to be good luck, so let's see. Maybe it will be good luck for Crawley, who after a good start to the season have trickled away a little bit. Meanwhile, um, Mansfield, the opposition for today, have sort of coasted on quite well. I think they're in the playoff position at the moment. Both teams could still make it though, don't get me wrong. So yeah, it should be a good Oh, I really like that, all the banners, that's awesome. Pretty small, modest looking ground, but well maintained. There's a lot of, like I said, the band park outside is really good. Uh, free parking as well, can't really go wrong with that. Um, I'm not sure, too sure to expect match day atmosphere wise. I know Matt the Groundhog has come here and said it wasn't the best, but then travelled with them away and they were a lot of fun. So we'll see, you get one or the other maybe. Um, like I said, it's top half clash in League 2, so it could be good. Time alone will tell. Last season was the first season that the, the ownership had their full campaign because of course they had the squiggle on the front of the shirt. Which uh, I thought it looked quite cool actually, but it was certainly unique. But yeah, they seem to be having something of a better campaign this time and they nearly got relegated last year. Um, but the wheels are starting to fall off a little bit, so hopefully they can get back in the range today. We'll see. <laughs> Good header to be fair, Mansfield lead 1-0.
On the jinx here, but the ratio like football to gold my fractions are really high in this game so far. So many shots. I think both teams basically playing right on this field. It's largely held in that. Holding in the box and Crawley have been given a penalty. It was from a set well a set piece hadn't even been delivered yet. <laughs> Wild decision. He did it but I don't think I've ever seen that happen before in a game. It was nice to have a first. Yeah, level of the break. Let's see how it gets for us. Me and Bob as I do, and uh, the guy in front of me regretted his tea choice, and the guy behind me got two bottles, so influencing the nation. A couple of clubs at a time. happened after the red card, it's just a lot of, you know, it, the game's already done at that point. But to be fair, I think probably were a little unlucky, they were probably the better team when the 2-1 um, goal went in and then they managed to score straight up and that sort of secured the point. You know. 
Well worth a visit at the Broadfield Stadium, I'd say, overall.